Millbrook, Alabama. On the day after Christmas, there has been a violent break-in. The suspect smashed a plate glass door and a wooden panel to gain access to this rural home. You the closet, Inside, you the, the Christmas tree is ruined. The floor is littered with shattered ornaments and broken glass. I ain't never heard of it. What kind of Grinch would do this so close to the holidays? Before officers can even begin to investigate that question, they realize the suspect may still be nearby. The noise from the back of the house is inhuman, and for good reason. The suspect who bashed, crashed, and trashed this holiday home is not human. This 150-pound deer is responsible for all the damage. Stand there looking at me. Apparently, the deer attacked the glass door because he thought his reflection was another young buck challenging him. Now the animal is staring down the officers in the same way. The town's animal control officer is called in. I'm going to try my best not to let him out. Just don't help. The wildlife officer goes in first, with two policemen bringing up the rear. But the deer isn't going anywhere without a fight. Even when the owner of the house tries to help, the determined deer nearly gets loose. The men finally get a handle on the brawling buck, but the animal doesn't like it. And he definitely objects to having his feet tied and his face covered with a jacket. The deer keeps struggling even after he's taken outside. Moments later, the four men count down and release the deer all at once. There's only one problem. None of them took the jacket off the buck's head. Despite their blunder, the deer realizes he's been set free. He makes a break for it. Oh, no. Moments later, the blinded buck gets rid of the jacket and goes bounding oh. off back into the woods. Oh, the animal gets his freedom, and the family gets a post-Christmas cleanup job that will take until New Year's Day. This deer was half Bambi and half Rambo. But when the buck stopped here, his reindeer games left the family with a mess. And three officers with a reminder, this is why they call it wildlife.